Alright guys, um, I have decided to build my own dedicated 22 upper. Um, in doing research for this project, I could not find any information on how to assemble your own. I found a bunch of places where you could buy dedicated 22 uppers, but that's not what I wanted to do. I'm a builder. I like to build things. Um, so this is probably going to be a series of videos. I'm just starting to get parts in as I get money. This series of videos is just going to detail the actual assembly. I'm going to try and do my best to actually get videos of me assembling it and putting it together. Now this video I'm just going to go over some of the parts I have already and we'll do updates as I get more parts. Um, so uh, what I started out with is a this is a Smith and Wesson MMP Sport upper receiver. I bought it stripped. Um, basically, no ejection port cover, no forward assist because uh, the 22 conversion kit that I have is a CMMG stainless. Doesn't have forward assist, so why do I need it? Also, it was pretty cheap. I mean, there are tons of people out there trying to get rid of these things because they bought these MP15 Sports and then swapped the upper receiver to a mil spec with a four, with a um, forward assist and ejection cover. So I put a, one ad up on Air15.com, and within a few hours, I had somebody that said they had one to get rid of so I know there's plenty of these out there I mean he said there were zero rounds fired he bought it immediately swapped receivers so adjust camera There we go. Smith and Wesson. Whoopee. I mean, this thing is mint. Not a mark on it. Got a good price on it. And of course, this is a uh, CMMG dedicated 22 upper charging handle. It's made of polymer, which I'm not exactly thrilled about, but. This is going to be a plinker. Basically, the difference between normal charging handle and this is the groove in the bottom of this is much, much shallower. And that keeps the rounds from getting jammed up above the 22 bolt. And then, since it's a dedicated, it does not have a recess for the gas tube to go into. See, they, uh, they also make one of these that you can use on conversion bolts that has the recess for the gas tube but um... yeah it's pretty cheap so I thought it wouldn't be a bad idea but here's the barrel it's a CMMG barrel of course it's a M4 profile um, I had originally bought this with the intent of making a dissipator build but I guess some other guys had tried that and it didn't work out because this is actually I can't see because this thing it's a pain in the butt to get off and I don't want to have to put it back on yet so I just got enough of it off so you could see the writing on there it's the profile of a 14 and a half inch barrel because there's actually about an inch and a half of barrel that goes into the receiver so they can make it shorter without having to be an NFA item and uh, the flash hider I'm going to put on there is the standard A2 that I have left over from uh, building that thing back there. Uh.